This week's Changemaker uses art to heal, empower, and unify underrepresented communities. And joining me now in studio is Hazel, an art therapist with Sky Art Chicago, and also the creator of Fist Up Afro Out. Thanks for being with us. Yes, thank you so much for having me. I'm very honored to be here today. I'm excited that you're here. As our final Black History Month Changemaker, I reached out to Sky Art Chicago, and they said that you would be the person that we should highlight in this and what you're doing. Talk about your work with Sky Art. Yes, I love Sky Art. So for a long time, um, when I first started my career as a therapist, social worker, it was really hard for me to find alignment in my artistic skills and professionally. And Sky Art does that. Um, we do a lot of work on the southeast, south side, and west sides of Chicago. We just opened a new location. And um, we find different mediums of art to find our children and families to express themselves. And so it's, it's, just, it's just nice, you know, just to have that context with Sky Art. And it also aligns with just my other professional and artistic things that I'm doing as well. You mentioned how much you really support and love working with Sky Art. Can you talk about like a, your favorite program, maybe that art is used to heal through? Absolutely. What I love about Sky Art is that we have different mediums of art that we use. So we have ceramics, we have painting, we have sewing, all different types of art. And I just love that every day you come into Sky Art. Um, you know, I'm in different schools as well, that you can choose any form of art that you want, that you feel like you want to express yourself through, and that's my favorite part about Sky Art. And so through Sky Art, you do the work, but you also have your own organization. Tell me about that and what inspired you to create it. Absolutely. So I started Fist Up Afros Out back in 2016, and pretty much kind of for the same reason. You know, I didn't understand how I was going to be a professional and an artist at the same time. And so Fist Up Afros Out was a way that I was able to find a, a gap in certain areas of our communities. And I wanted to fill that gap artistically to help people um, find their true calling um, through programs, activities, and different seminars, webinars, things like that. So give me an example of what, if someone is taking part in one of the programs, what they would be doing or how they would benefit from that. Absolutely. Um, I'll give an example of, we have free financial literacy courses. So I try to do things that um, our community needs. I'll find a need that we have within our communities and I'll say, let's figure out a way that's fun, artistic, cool for the adults, cool for the kids that we can do to help benefit our community. And so financial literacy, my course that I did was really great, um, even beyond Chicago. I just want to be able to do that for all underrepresented communities, you know, everywhere. I love that you've been able to really link all your passions yeah. with the projects that you're doing. Yeah. So one thing that stood out to me about you is that Fist Up Afros Out is grassroots. You Absolutely. fund it, you worked through your own resources to make it happen. If someone's watching, how can they support and also take part? Yeah, that is a great question. So of course, you know, in order to grow, in order to help mass amount of people, we're gonna need more hands, we're gonna need uh, volunteers, we're gonna need uh, funding, of course, and a dope way to do that is you can visit my Instagram or my website and you can learn more about what we do. Uh, we have a donation button as well, but volunteers and people to join the team is more what we need right now um, to be able to uh, just reach who we need to reach. So. And last thing, I only have about 15 seconds left. Tell me quickly, that, that, that connection between art and healing yeah. for you. Yeah, um, honestly, it's my everyday life. I think the pandemic really showed me that we need other avenues to express ourselves. And I just love that art is one that is just showing to be very prominent and very successful with all types of individuals. And I really love that. Awesome, it's so great to hear what you're doing. Hazel, thank you for being with us. Thank you. The art therapist with Sky Art Chicago also, also with Fist Up Afro Out, thank you. Yes, thank you so much. All right, it's 918 right now. We want you to know that if you know someone that you're thinking, man, I know a change maker too, somebody really doing good things. We wanna hear from you. Send your suggestions to CBS Chicago Tips at cbs.com.